Hi, this is Jared from Motion Sound Studios in Los Angeles, California. Right now I'm going to talk to you about how to develop a relaxed guitar strumming wrist. When you're first learning guitar, strumming can be very difficult. It can be hard to find a position and a way of strumming that doesn't hurt after 10 minutes or so of strumming. Um, but learning some techniques and ways to keep relaxed are going to help you learn and create a strumming technique that you can stick with and it won't be painful for you. So I'm going to help you with that. The main thing when you're learning how to strum with your guitar is learn how to keep your wrist relaxed. A lot of people when they're first playing guitar have a tendency to keep it taut and use their elbow to move back and forth. And when you do that, it can be really hard to get a lot of notes in succession and make them sound good. It's very taut and it's not loose and natural. And what you really need to do is shake out your wrist and keep it loose. And when you're first learning how to do these strumming techniques, it shouldn't even sound good. It should just be you kind of learning how to just let your wrist fall across the guitar. And that's going to help you get out of the habit of keeping it taut. And once you get comfortable with your wrist, then just doing basic alternating pick things, letting your hand come up and down naturally and falling. And it's really just like anything else. The more you practice that, the better you're going to get. And eventually you can get a very relaxed sounding strum like... And because I'm not playing it so hard and so taut, it really sounds nice and gentle. And that's what we want sometimes. So this has been Jared with Motion Sound. Today I taught you about how to develop a relaxed guitar strumming wrist.